Welcome back to Harvard Hawks basketball with Coach John Gallagher here on CBTV Sports. And time to meet the elder statesman on your roster, the graduate student. How does a graduate student, in this case John Peterson, though you'll learn his full name in a minute, how does he end up here after playing collegiately elsewhere? Well, we call him Uncle John. You know, he's the older guy. Uh, but no, John, his dad called, was calling around, and uh, we looked at some film when he was at Sanford. Uh, and we were really just impressed, and I thought we needed an older guy just for practice and the development of our practice habits, uh, and he's done a phenomenal job for us. All right, here is our profile of John Peterson. You know him as John Peterson, but his birth name is something a little different. I'm actually the fourth, Arvid John Peterson the fourth. Growing up, my uh, parents, you know, they figured they'd just call me John instead of Arvid because, you know, who's named Arvid, you know, kind of a different name, so they just figured John would be a lot easier for, you know, my friends. And his new friends in Connecticut, here at the University of Hartford as a graduate student, using his final year of eligibility to play for the Hawks after playing previously in Birmingham, Alabama, in the Southern Conference. I was at Sanford University in Birmingham, Alabama. I uh, injured my shoulder during one of the games, and I, um, you know, I wasn't so sure if I wanted to play basketball for another year. I, uh, I tried to get into law school, couldn't get in, and after you know watching my team play and watching March Madness, you know, I just it was one of those things, you know, where I just I just had to play one more year. How did he find a program to take him for just one year, one season, one that could use his experience, his length, his shooting touch, if only for the short term? Well, his father, Arvid Peterson the third, went to work. My dad did some uh, uh, calling around the country to some college coaches to see if they would take, you know, a fifth-year senior in. And sure enough, Hartford, you know, gladly took me in. And I'm very, you know, appreciative and blessed that they did that. Uh, a lot of phone calls. He said his phone bill at his office went up, you know, drastically because of it. You know, he was calling coaches in California and, you know, just all over the place. So I've been through a lot, you know, four years at Sanford, you know, been through the ups and downs, so I kind of know what to expect, and, you know, basketball is a really long season, you know, there really isn't an off month for basketball, you're always training, and uh, just the season itself, you know, goes a long time, we have, you know, if you're good, you play 30 plus games, and, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's just really hectic, you know, a long season, a lot of practices, a lot of games, a lot of traveling, and, uh, you know, I, I'm used to that, you know, going through it for four years. Peterson's shooting touch could pay dividends for the Hawks in a big spot, but he's thinking team success first. Not going to single myself out, you know, saying that, oh, I'm going to hit the big shot. You know, I, to be honest, I really don't care who hits that big shot. I just, you know, I just want to get into that NCAA tournament. You know, it'd be the first time in school history that that happened and that that would happen. And, you know, that's what my vision is, and I think that's what everybody's vision is on the team. After Samford, John's first thought was to follow in his dad's footsteps and go to law school. But his test scores weren't quite high enough. And that was one more reason to play one more season of college basketball. If I would have gotten in, I probably would have gone to law school. But, you know, I'm glad I'm here one more year, you know, working on my uh, master's degree in early childhood education. And, uh, you know, it can't get better than that. A future working with kids is a possibility for Peterson. But another crack at law school for this recommitted student is also a possibility. After all, he's got the perfect name for law, doesn't he? Law offices of Arvid John Peterson IV. I like that. Arvid John Peterson IV. You don't have a special first name we don't know about. Do no, you? no. Middle name, though. No. Middle name. Yes. John Michael. John so Michael. I grew John up every, Dominic and John Michael. Everybody in my neighborhood called me John Michael growing up. All right. Fair enough. Now we know.